This is a spooky story called The Dog Under the Bed. And this is a story about something that happened to my friend Will when we were growing up. Now, Will had a dog, and they were best friends. He was the best dog that you could ask for. And that dog would lick your face and lick your hands, and he would lick your toes if you gave him the chance. He was just such a sweet dog. And one night, Will's parents went out to a party. And this was the 1980s, so that's what parents did. They would go out for the whole night, and they would leave the kids home alone all night. And Will didn't mind because he had the dog with him, so he felt okay with that. They would just hang out at home. And when it got to be bedtime, Will crawled into bed, and he tried to fall asleep on his own. And that night, there was a big storm raging outside. There was thunder and lightning and the whole bit. And Will heard a little... (laughs) from under his bed, and he heard, and he said, it's okay, pup, it's just a storm, and he dangled his hand over the edge of the bed, and he could feel his sweet dog licking his hand, and, oh, you're a good pup, don't worry about it, and pretty soon he fell asleep, because he felt so comforted that his dog was there licking his hand, and then, much later, his parents came home. And his parents woke him up and they said, Will, you left the dog outside all night. He's been locked outside. He's wet and cold. How could you do that? And Will was so confused and he said, What are you talking about? The dog's been inside all night under my bed. And just at that moment, ba-dum, 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 the dog came bounding into Will's bedroom and jumped up on his bed and the dog was soaking wet. It was obvious that the dog had been outside all night. And in that case, if the dog had been outside all night, what had been under Will's bed? Hmm? 